just really want to make something out of this. I just feel like I don't have time. Alone in this house There's no one There's a lot of things to want in this world. But lately all I've wanted is more time to work on this channel. You see, I've spent the last month of my job designing and prepping a new storefront. And that means I'm taking a lot of photos and videos, just not for 52 weeks. And in turn, I've become discouraged. I want to be making really good videos that help people, but I can't force anything to happen as fast as I want it to, especially when there are bills to pay. But the best way to get to the bottom of this dilemma is by explaining where the heck I got my desk. Bill Gates gave me this desk. Let me explain by uh, telling you what I did for work every day in 2018. And I know some of you will relate to this, but that was my job every single day, sending emails. <laughs> but all you need to know is that I was working out of an attic in Provo, Utah, negotiating brand deals with YouTubers when... Hello, it's Bill Gates. I want to buy your company. Yeah, so Bill Gates bought the company I was working for. Straight up. <laughs> and with a bit more funding, we were able to move out of an attic and into a much larger office with fancy desks. And in the process, I was able to keep my ghetto desk from Ikea. Yeah, that'll keep their attention. And I totally forgot about this until writing this video, but this very same desk, two years ago, was where I sat and dreamt about one thing, using my camera for a job rather than sitting and sending emails. That's all I wanted. <laughs> and where am I now? I got everything that I wanted. And it looks like human nature is to get somewhere and want even more. I sometimes sit at my desk and daydream about being able to make these videos full time. But when I look back two years ago, I see a version of myself that quit his job to play with his cameras, and that version of Matt got burned and definitely wasn't prepared to go full-time freelance. But man, did he practice making videos a lot. Flash forward two years and somehow, I'm walking into a store that I helped design with my work scattered everywhere. Look who just jumped up on the scene. Pocket full of green, but the leather and all. I beat that nigga named Jamal. And I realized I unknowingly fulfilled one of the most crazy goals of my life that I set out to accomplish two years ago. Using my camera every day for a job. But, but here I am. Thinking about greener pastures, I am such an ungrateful hoe. I cannot express this enough, my job rocks. I was completely unaware of what I needed until it hit me. And going from designing a storefront to seeing it come to life in just a few short weeks, <sighs> it just felt like the end of a chapter for me. I have to be present and patient and although my wants and expectations for myself have evolved over time, man, it felt so good to, to realize that I accomplished something that I set at this very desk two years ago, thinking it was just a dream. It may take a while, but I promise it leads to good places. It's easy to pretend there's nothing going on outside. I feel so far away from everyone, so I can't keep me inside. Every night I come home.
home to my little house The floor creaks and my window won't shut Every night I look up to the ceiling fan The dust collects as it circles back Every night I come home to my little house